Pine Grove Zoo in Little Falls welcomes a new baby kangaroo to their family this season. Our newest reporter, Rolene Joseph, has more on the story. Two and a half pound kangaroo arrived at Pine Grove Zoo this Tuesday. The zoo is excited to welcome her. It's always fun when you have a new species at the zoo, but I think a kangaroo is going to be a big hit because it's so different than any other animal we have and any other animal that Minnesota has. So for people to see Sydney, it's something really fun and exciting for them. Hernandez says Sydney will be an important part of the zoo. Guests will be able to learn more about kangaroos' habitats, including movements and body structure. So by having Sydney here and having this new and fun, exciting animal, we can talk about her and also the habitat she's from and other animals that are living in her habitat that may be in trouble. And we can share other animals that are in Minnesota even that are facing habitat loss or other important issues that are causing their declines. Sydney was born last November and she is still being bowel fed. Visitors will be able to have up close interactions with the kangaroo. Um, right now we have an exhibit that's just south of the petting stable. It's fairly large. Eventually we want to be able to have a patio out there so people can go out and actually sit in a patio and be surrounded by kangaroos. More than $5,000 was raised in just five minutes to get the baby kangaroo to the zoo. Local businesses and community members donated money to bring in new animals. We're going to grow with, with her in knowledge and um, being able to just watch an animal that we've not been able to, to be around. So it's going to be a learning experience for her and for us. One visitor is excited to see the baby kangaroo. It's not something that you're going to see around here, so that's always something new. My kids are going to love it. It's going to be something really good for them, new experiences. Another kangaroo will be arriving in a month to provide Sydney with some companionship. Reporting from Little Falls, Rolling Joseph, Lakeland News. Visitors can visit Sydney at her exhibit once the weather is warmer. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.